Hey, old man. Um, I just heard that you were uh, moving on and leaving me again. So I just wanted to take a second to honor you. Um, being somebody who gets to live in the area, it's been such a blessing to be able to see all the ways that your hard work has has paid off, has blessed this community, and to just watch it grow from where it was to where it is now is incredible. Um, I love you, man. I can't say thank you enough for all the times you've been there for me, been there in my corner fighting. Um, your friendship means more to me than you know. Uh, you've really been just such a blessing and an honor to me, and I know you're gonna go and bless so many more people um, with your leadership, you and your family. And so I just wanted to say thank you for everything. Know that you're always in my heart and in my prayers, man. I love you a lot. Well, hey there, Ben. I'm definitely going to miss you here in Texas. I will never forget our endeavors at reaching in the dorms of Seton Hall, mostly because uh, you didn't really look like a freshman whatsoever, so that was really, that was really hilarious to me. Um, I am just grateful for the our friendship and from all that I've learned from you here in Texas, and I wish you, Teresa, and your family the best this next chapter of your life. I love you, man. Hello, Ben. I was there in the beginning when we both showed up to the house. And I'd like to honor you for being a patient father. Patient father. So in Minnesota and always remember Welcome to Texas, Ben! Ben, brother, I I don't even know where to start. I I think we've known each other for, for eight years now since the really the second week of my freshman year. Um, you're the first missionary that reached out to me. The guy that they really evangelized me and brought me in, even though that was through boxing and you basically just beat me up for a year. Uh, it worked. Um, I, I don't know where I'd be uh, without you, Ben. You, you've been a rock in my life and, and the lives of so many men and women in Texas and, and really for that community. Um, and I, I'm so grateful for your life and what you've done. I'm excited what the future has for you. I love you, brother. Peace. Hey, bro. This is Danny here. I'm super excited to have this opportunity uh, to spend some time honoring you. And I just want to honor you for your great dedication and commitment to your community here in Texas and specifically at Texas State. Uh, over the years I've gotten to get to know you as a man and as a, as a father and as a husband and it's just been a great blessing to know you, to see your commitment to your faith and calling others on to be the best that they can be. And so I'm super thankful uh, for our brotherhood and I'm confident that wherever you go, the Lord is going to continue to bless you and use you uh, to be a witness. And so, uh, yeah, man, I love you and I wish the best for you. Ben, I want to honor you and affirm you for the man that you are, the leader you have chosen to be, for your faithfulness to this community. Um, and that goes back years, yes, you are old, <laughs> just for being a man who runs to the scripture to seek the Lord and his written word. There's not been a time that I haven't seen you with your Bible in worship. And because you are faithful and know his heart and know his voice to speak for yourself, for your family, especially for this community. I can say, even as I am leaving, we are going to miss you and whatever the Lord calls you. I pray that he continues to be faithful as you are faithful to him. Hey Ben, I just want to honor you real quick for um, the ways that you've served SPO Texas for seven, eight years now. Um, I hope you just see the fruits of your labor. Um, so men like me um, can come to know Jesus in a personal way. And my life is like forever changed because of this organization. You play like a very pivotal role in that. And I know um, you'll continue to change men's hearts in Minnesota as well. And then also I just wanna honor you for um, the way you lead your family. Um, the way you raise your daughters and lead your wife spiritually. Um, it's just so beautiful. Um, and the opportunities I've had to see you uh, just for a family dinner or whatnot. And I think every man should look up to you as a father, um, as a brother, and as a son. Um, I love you, Ben. Hey, Ben. Um, I just wanted to honor you. 
um, for the way you've served um, SVO Texas and the way you ran after the Lord. Uh, I would not be here today if it wasn't for your yes and the way you've laid down your life um, to serve the Lord and bring people to the church. Um, so I just wanted to thank you for your yes and the sacrifice that you've made to make SVO Texas what it is today. Good luck in Minnesota. We love you.